What's happening, Captain? This your boy, CB Hunts. And look what just brought down to my man cave today. We have here the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Gold Labels Flashpoints Wonder Woman. Now, like I said in other videos of this line, I didn't really like all the figures in the line. I, just, I think to me, they're like. I didn't really like how they look. I ain't gonna say they're all trash. Well, except except Aquaman. But I'm just not really feeling this wave. The only reason I got this wave is because the uh, cyborg figure. So this is the last piece I need for the hand scope. And like I said, I went on a, on a hunt this morning. Uh, kind of find out same thing like the super girl with her is is only two per store. Like, like, like. I kind of find that weird. Knowing a whole lot of people is going to buy their stuff lately. I don't even follow them doing that, or, or, or if, if Target's doing that, having only like two, only like two per store. Now, I can see by having having like one, like, like, like a Atom series in there, just probably the one. But at, least, but, but at least have like five of the other one, at least. So, and same thing with this one. I got the same thing at the same time as Supergirl with my home, with my homeboy, with my homeboy Eric. So I got one, and uh, and uh, he got one. So not gonna have this intro too long, but it already is already. <laughs> so we gonna take a closer look at uh, Wonder Woman. Myself, my name is your boy C. About to go on that spending spree. Cause I'll be looking for deals that my eyes can see. Nega Mentel even has rose sometimes more greens. How long it's been, yo? eBay, Amazon, even Big Bad. Equals the big three. And man, that's so sad, bro. And man, what's this shit in the show? New figs looked at myself. Interest isn't on sale. It's lit. Oh, we no time to wait. Don't procrastinate. Quality rates. Figures coming home with me like dates. Within the film, I'll be caught. Figure poses with the law and articulated form. I'm sick with it all, my lord, I miss the joy that the new toys brings And I tell you all what's out, get my peeps a ring I'm a collector of a sort, soon this YouTube thing I say what's happening, Captain, post it for my crew to sing So sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride As you watch me support, hanging by my side This is CB Hunt's Toy Channel Tour Guide And you see the packaging that Big Farm Toys has all black boxing And it's trimmed in, uh, uh, White and blue, you see the figure inside with all it comes with, and you see on the bottom of the uh, uh, build a figure. This is like number four in the whole wave. Side of the box got a name and and the comic book that she comes from. Other side about the same, but they got a little side little uh, 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 a window back of the box. Show all the figures of the bottom in this wave and show the image of Cyborg and all the pieces that actually come with this one. So, once we get back, we're going to have this bad boy out the box and we will see what it do with a Wonder Woman. And now we got this bad boy outside the box. Uh, she looks okay. Not my favorite Wonder Woman, but like I said, McFarlane Toys could make some excellent figures because he did show off the like classic Wonder Woman. And trust me, I will be going to go pick up that one as well. But we do have this one here. But the only reason I got this is because the one thing that you see on the far left, and that is the head sculpt of Sasabo. Not gonna go into full detail of it because he will be having his own video showing off the whole figure and everything all in, it, in the whole package. So with Wonder Woman uh, she does come with a black stand as you can see here. Got no DC logo. Ain't nothing all too fancy with that one. And she comes with her own card. Same image on the back of the box as you can see. And she does has a bio, so if you want to read it, 
pause it. Here it goes. And with one woman, she does. She does also come with a sword, and this is the type of sword that she has here. I don't know what it is with with, a, with every time they put a sword sword with her, it is super fl flimsy and can easily be warped or whatever. But I do like on the blade, it looks like all look all like or now it's like like uh, she had like extreme 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 battle like that. And I also like the uh, um, hilt as well. So, talking about the main girl herself, Wonder Woman. This is her and her helmet. Don't know what type of helmet this is, but looks okay. Um, got the shoulder pads, red top with the. Uh, uh, Under Woman type W on the front. You got a gold type type color. Got a little belt. It kind of drapes down on the front. You got the uh, chainmail underneath, like that black chainmail underneath. See the armbands. You can see like armor of actual like like knight's armor, like like armor but different. Same thing with the piece down here, and that same uh, chainmail, black chainmail. You can see the the type of design that goes down the leg. You can see like the black gloves, looking look kind of nice. I would say like I don't really like the figure too much, but I do like how it looks. Just just have like like one issue. I'm gonna get to it now. You can see the sh the, the uh, shin guard looking quite nice. Like 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 I said, like the the armor. Place of the legs and the arm looks all like it's been like in battle. But the one thing I said I do not like is the boots. You see the type of boots right here. Does not have any artic uh, 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 articulation of the boots, but it has this weird like pin type joint. I guess it might hold the feet up a little bit more better instead of having the ankle joints. But it just seemed kind of seemed kind of like seemed kind of, seemed kind of like weird. To have that, but we will see whenever I take pictures of her. But this is look, this is look a little weird. That little chain to kind of like at your helmet and a cape going on the back. No much to the design in the front. So with all that, we'll go with her articulation. Can't really move her head back because the hair got a harder plastic. Look down just a little bit, tilt side to side, not that much. There's the arms that high, bicep swivel, double elbows, not too much hands to the wrist because it looks like the boots got the weird like a like, like a pin type joint in the side of the gloves, same way as the boots. No ab articulation. They barely even bend back or whatever. Move left and right though. And legs can do the splits that far forward that much. Uh, has a, 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 a single knee. Move, can can move around the boot? Let's see. Yeah. Yes, can, you can move around the boot, but the no articulation in the ankles at all. But like I said, the only reason I got this figure is because uh, I wanted to build a cyborg. Apologize, I didn't go into full details like I normally do with figures with this line. Not, like I said, I'm not too hyped about it. When you get my honest opinion, she looks nice, but it's just not me. It, 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 it ain't my cup of tea. Uh, uh, and now, we're going to show a little size comparisons uh, with other figures standing next to Wonder Woman. This is my review on a Fallen Toys DC Multiverse Gold Labels Flashpoints Wonder Woman. 
Hope y'all enjoyed this review. Trust me, boy, the fun time making it. Ain't no ever review. I will take pictures. This is my Instagram right here where I will leave links down below. We go and check those out. And your boy is on TikTok. While I take those same pictures, post over there, I'll just add just a little bit of a flair. This year, boy, CB Hunts. Hope you have a blessed one. But trust me, I can wait to catch you in that next one.